Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my last Vex 2 run, at least posted run. Um, I'm going to be incorporating a ton of new strats and skips and whatnot, and I'll try to explain them as they come up. Because I have my other runs posted, I'm not going to be explaining everything I'm doing, all the optimization things I'm doing, because I explained them already in my other runs. So you can check those out if you want to know what I'm doing, when I'm doing it, and how I'm doing what I'm doing. But, so this run I'm going to be a little more quiet on, at least when it comes to uh, talking like strats and stuff like that. Of course, I will be explaining the new ones, and a lot of them come from the beginning, so I will be talking a lot at the beginning. But, let's just get this run started. So, I got my trusty timer here, and we're going to go for PB. My PB right now is 542. No, 5, oh, I'm sorry, not 5, that's a different game. Uh, it's 840. Good lord, I wish. Alright, so 840 is the time to beat. So here we go. Uh, I don't know why I started that. Three, two, one, go. Alright, so a new strat right off the bat. First thing we do is we jump immediately. Gets us to the tutorial faster. Next is I decided to learn the hitbox on those spikes. And the reason I do that is so that way I can do that. Which allows me to get a time of 15 a lot more consistently. And as you saw, I just ran right over the spikes. And I just did three per, uh, what we call perfect wall jumps. If you wall jump on the same exact frame you land on the wall, you will almost, you will not slide at all. And you'll do uh, basically a side slide cancellation, but we just call them perfect wall jumps. I've been grinding this level for six hours, and I've only gotten this skip nine times. So, get hyped. Got it. Oh my gosh, okay. I cannot believe I got that. But the scary part's not over, because I gotta make act two and three flawless as well, uh, in order for this to mean anything. That's pretty good, right there. God, I can't believe I made that. So, optimization right there. I'm gonna explain what I just did there uh, as soon as this act is done, because uh, a lot of serious time, I didn't make that jump. A lot of serious time here for this act. Get up there. Yes. First try, come on. Yes! 41, is that a record? No, 38. I was, over. I was way too excited. 42 is one of mine. Here's a new strat. Here we go. Difficult strat. Not as difficult as a level one, or act one. God, I can't believe, I still can't believe I made that. Um, but basically it's an old strat revamped. I decided to learn the, um, how to make that a lot more reliable, a lot more consistent. It's still difficult. Uh, it looks difficult. Um, but we uh, do a pretty good job at it. Now, I think I got the jump on this nicely. No, that was horrible. But we got the edge, so I'm, I'm, it's fine. 35. I think this is 32? Yeah, 32. Alright, act 4. So let me explain the um, thing I did in Act 2. First I uh, do a classic strat right here, Boop. use that to push me up. Uh, basically falling, when you hit the water, you have, that was close, you have a specific amount of momentum that you have in falling in the water, come on, push, if I can get this perfect, yes, Oh, are you going to be mean to me like that? Alright, fine. By the way, these are no longer my least favorite enemies in the game. They just are dumb, and they should not exist. But I just I figured out the hitbox for them, and I worked it out, and I, I've become close to those. Maybe one, one of these times I will explain the, the, the heck too. But essentially, if you fall in the water, I want to get a 14 for this so bad. If you fall in the water, oh, and by the way, 13 seconds is possible. I got 15. That sucks. God. I've been getting 14 all day, and then the run 
I happen to get 14, or right, whatever. I actually like the beginning of this act. And no, I'm never gonna... Oh, oh. oh I didn't make it. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna stride. So falling in the water, turning your body will cancel the momentum that you gain from falling in the water. Also, it's faster to back up into that. Uh, so you can actually two cycle this. And so we want to use, and falling in the water is faster than swimming. So we want to use that as much as we can. And I knew I was going to die right there. You die twice and it says stuck? Like, I just died twice. Come on. We're gonna do it, we're gonna get it. If this goes flawlessly, it, really the run depends on Act 8. And I've been dying on that spike all week, so I'm glad I was able to do it. I wasn't pushing the block far enough, but at the same time I had the fear of not it pushing it too much, which you lose a lot of time doing. So, I don't know. But I made it, so I don't care. We can make it. But all, the run really depends on Act 8, because that's the hardest act in the game. I mean, with Act 1, there's only that one s frame perfect. Boom! You turd. Alright, well, other than that, that's... That's good. Alright, here we go. If I can do this flawlessly, I will have a run. Which I've never done in my entire life. Which I've put well over probably 40 or 50 hours in this game. And it's a game that's 8 minutes long. It's 9 minutes long. Um, dying there is actually okay because the pattern that I got... What? I don't think I've ever died on that before. I'm not gonna risk it again. Crowd favorite strat right here. I probably could have made it. Uh, I've done it before. But. <laughs> I know it's all blurry on camera, but that just. Oh man. Makes me cringe every time. All right, we're at 649 right now. This could be record. So um, the hype starts now. Yeah, so much, so much tricking the hitboxes. Here's something optimized. Did you see that? I didn't jump for the key. Uh, jumping for the key uh, slows you down. Also, the key gets stuck right there, which is funny. Uh, jumping for the key slows you down. Um, so I only do that in practice <laughs> now. And again, me and those things have gotten so close that I'm not worried about them hitting me anymore. They're just slow and painful. What? All right, there's another place I've never died before. Um, sub eight minutes. I don't know. You'd have to be almost flawless, probably coming up with new, a couple new optimization things. If I don't die at all, on this, I will have a PB. Around eight minutes, probably. So here we go. My camera battery is dying right now as we speak, and it's plugged into the wall. I don't get it. So here we go. I hope that's a camera. Time. 8.35.30. Wow, that was close. I don't get it. Why is my camera battery dying? Oh, whatever. 
Whatever, I don't care. I did it. I got the time that I wanted. 8.35. A couple major deaths, but not too bad. Um, that beats my PB by 5 seconds. So, here we go. Let's see, Vex 2. So my old time was 8.40. This is 8.35.30. Pretty good. Pretty good. Alright, so that's it for Vex 2.